Welcome back to my channel guys. In this video I'm going to show you how to install a Denali plow on a Polaris Ranger. This is a 72 inch Denali plow with box ends and I do have a hydraulic uh, cylinder that turns the plow. So uh, if this helped you guys out please uh, hit the subscribe button and the like button. If you guys want to see me do some plowing with this uh, as soon as we get snow leave a comment below. So I got my mounting bracket here. Uh, I've removed all the bolts. You, as you can see, uh, bolt holes here and in the back. It is if you have two people, it is a little bit easier just to hold it up to get the bolts in while you align it. So the trick with this is to just get the bolts all started, and then uh, then tighten them up. Don't tighten them up right away. So I got two bolts here two and two on the outside. Now I'm going to stick the bolts that go to the back of the mount up and underneath. And this plate sits on top of the frame of the razor. <laughs> and then underneath, bolt here and bolt here. Uh, once you get all the bolts in, go ahead and tighten them up. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Once we get our plow mount on and we get all our bolts tightened up, we're going to want to put on our plow and align it up to the mounting uh, bracket. Uh, pretty simple. So we're going to take our winch, hook it up, and <clears throat> we're going to line these up. Put your four-wheeler in neutral, and you can kind of roll it until where you need it. And... Look at that. They have washers. Line them up. So I do want to mention that I did change. This is the original pin that they had that goes through the clip. I do put a bolt through it. Uh, I had an issue several times of this pin popping off when I'm plowing. And the plow ends up bending. So I put these bolts in. I have my plow on now. I have the uh, electronic uh, steering for the plow, which makes a huge difference. This right here was about $700. Um, I've had it for, this will be my fourth season. Uh, it still works pretty good. Now I do my connection. I leave this connection uh, wired up all summer long and I just tape it up so no water gets in it or anything. So now I have the connector connected. I always wrap it with a little electrical tape to help protect it against snow, water, and ice. This is the end of the video. If you guys have any questions on the plow or want to see the plow in use, go ahead and leave a comment below. Thanks for watching.